हेलो फ्रेंड्स दिस इज सुनील एंड वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल आईटी जंक्शन फॉर ऑल इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू हाउ टू ट्रांसपोज एक्सेल डेटा इन थ्री यूनिक वेज when i say a transpose excel data i mean rotating the table from vertical to horizontal or from horizontal to vertical if if you you can see over here there is a product column and quantity column these two column has been completely transformed into rows so if you want to transform the row into column that also you can do using transpose function let's see how we can do this in excel I'm going to show you three ways by which we can transpose data set from rows to columns or columns to rows. So first method is static method or dynamic or a fixed method. A static or fixed method. So in this method first we will what we will do we are going to select the complete data set. So I have selected the complete data set and then i am going to copy it either by control c or right click and then select copy and then we'll go to the cell let's see e3 cell i haven't and then right click and then choose option paste special and then click on the check box transpose and then click okay button here you go the data has been transposed from uh, from vertically to horizontally now again if you want this data to be transposed so what i'm going to do i'm going to select this complete data set and then go to the cell p1 and then right click again and choose paste special and then click on the check check box button transpose and then click on okay button here you go you got the same data as it was before so this is how we can transpose data by a static or fixed method now i am going to show you the dynamic method so in this dynamic method what i am going to do i am going to select some of the cells and then i am going to i am going to formula bar and then i am writing equal to and and then i'm writing transpose transpose and then i'm going to provide the array array means the complete data set which you want to transpose so over here the data set is this one so i have selected and then i'm going to close this bracket and then click control plus shift and then enter here you go you got the data transpose data but uh, there are three columns are missing so what we will do we are going to extend this but the data which we have has came is not correct so what we will do we will go again back to the this formula bar and then again type control shift enter here you go you got the transpose data now if you change this webcam value from 8000 to let's say 5000 this value will reflect over here so this is dynamic because if you click on any cell it is uh, it is showing the formula that's why if you change anything value over here you, this that value will be reflected over here now let's say uh, uh, again we have another method that is also a dynamic method so this method uh, let's see uh, if you see the product column the uh, data uh, the cell uh, cells name is a1 a2 a3 to a10 similarly for quantity column uh, the name cell name is b1 b2 b3 and till b10 so what we have to do we have to write this cell name but not Uh, yeah, we have to write the cell name in the horizontal direction here all the cell name is in the vertical direction so what i am going to do i am going to write a1 here b1 and then i am going to suffix it with let's say with uh, some unique word let's say my name sunil okay 
then I'm going to drag it. After that, I'm going to press Ctrl plus H. Here I have to find what? Sunil. And I have to replace with equal to. And then click on replace all. So here you go. You got the complete transpose data. And this is also dynamic because it is always you can see that it is represented by formula. So if you make any change over here, let's say 2000, it will reflect 2000 over here. So this is how we can transpose uh, rows to column and columns to rows. That's all for this video. If you have liked my video, please do subscribe my channel and do like the video. Thank you.